guys, I'm going to show you how to create favorites in Adobe Audition so you can quickly apply effects to your files in a uh, you know personalized manner and very efficiently. So the first thing we're going to need is a file. So we're going to go over to our files here. We're going to grab something. I think we'll grab this guy, throw it over here, and let's give it a listen. All right, guys, this is favorite, favorite, favorites. We're doing favorites. Now we can hear the uh, uh, the distortion in the background. We can hear um, there's a it's on audition. Hum. Favorites, 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 test file, favorites. Right now I'm not getting much of a reverb, but a lot of times uh, because I'm in a small room when I record, I do get some reverb. So um, we're going to apply multiple effects to this. Um, but really we want to apply all the effects we're going to commonly use on a file. So um, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go up to favorites and we're going to go start recording favorite. Favorite is currently being recorded. Favorites let you record one or more operations in the waveform editor as a single command. All right. So here we are. Um, a lot of times what I'll do is I'll go up and I'll do a hard limiter. Um, but first, let's go ahead and normalize to three decibels, minus three decibels here. So we're bringing the file up to three decibels. And uh, this is completely personal. You can personalize it any way you want. I'm just showing you how these favorites work. Um, I usually do adaptive noise reduction. Alrighty. And I also do D reverb with just the standard settings. And then um, let's see. Sometimes when you D reverb, it, it spikes your. Um, your audio a little bit in certain spots. So after that, I do a hard limiter and I do the hard limiter at minus three. All right, that's usually what I do to most of my files. So I'm gonna go up to favorites and stop recording favorite. I'm gonna name this Oh my goodness. We're gonna name it Raymond's fave. All right. We'll listen to it in favorites on audition. Favorites, 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 test file, favorites. We're gonna go. Sounds pretty good. Okay, so that's how you create a favorite. Now let me show you how to apply a favorite. All right, so we're gonna bring in another file. So with the first file, we had to do everything manually. And the idea with the favorite is instead of having to do it manually, you can go ahead and just apply it bulk. So right here I have favorites, but if you don't have this open, you would go to uh, window favorites and it would open it up for you. You can find your favorite in the list, Raymond's fave. And then you can go ahead and right click on it, run selected favorite and it does all of the edits. So let's see. Test file three, test file five, test file four. Yeah. Let's see what this noise is. And then we are going to record no. test file one. Just me making noise. Test file yeah, so there you go, guys. That's how you record a favorite in Audition and how you go ahead and apply the favorite in Audition. Now, you might not be able to hear all the changes made in the file because I'm going to go ahead and apply that same favorite I just made into this file here. So um, if you don't hear much difference or any difference on the audio, it's because I removed, <laughs> I removed all the impurities uh, that I mean to. So... That's how you create favorites and how you apply them quickly to a file so you can keep working and pump your uh, workout faster. You guys have a good day. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Is it too good to be true? I want this so much but don't know if I can trust you.
my mind's racing fast, trying to find the red flags. I'm used.